Lyle Collins is dealing with some stingers. Um, that's, you know, that's related to neck and back injuries usually. Um, Mike McCarthy, and this is, so this is, these are almost two separate issues. Mike McCarthy says it's not a long-term thing. It's not something that he's worried about. He should be available to practice against Tampa. So should you be concerned that Lyle Collins is going to miss time right now? No. Should you be concerned that this is maybe an injury that he's going to be dealing with? Yes. I mean, that, I don't know a better way to say it. Like, stingers typically tend to come back. This is something guys typically are deal with, which it it sucks that it's happening to another tackle. But this was this was Tyron's problem before. Right. Like, you know, Lyle's, he doesn't really have a stinger history, at least not a long one. So... Uh, yeah, I'd be lying if I said it didn't make me a little bit uneasy. Just that this won't, yeah. this probably won't be the only time we're talking about it. That doesn't mean he's going to miss a lot of time, but you never know. Well, and it also makes you a little bit uneasy because he didn't have the best training camp. You know, he 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 did get back out there. They played him more than really any other of those starting uh, linemen. But you know, he 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 didn't look like the same player we we saw when when you know I guess 2019. Yeah. I mean. Um, if you could call it rust, I guess. I mean, that's what you're hoping. That's what you call it. So to have this injury at this time, you were hoping things would kind of start ramping up more. But listen, he's about as tough as they get. He really is. He showed that his whole career, and I think he's a he is a pro. And so if there's anybody that I'm just counting on that's that's gonna get it when those lights turn on, it's Lyle.